Hey, how's it going? So first of all, I have to say this. The Mavic Mini update has made this drone a contender for anyone that wants to get cinematic footage. It went from being a toy and then updated to where you can adjust the camera settings to where you can now actually get some really nice videos with this drone. So I'm gonna talk about one thing that you need if you do wanna get cinematic footage with the Mavic Mini, but I'm also gonna show you a couple of other products from a company called PGY Tech. In case you don't know, PGY Tech is a company that makes a wide variety of accessories for DJI drones, as well as some action camera and pocket camera gear. Now I had my first opportunity to check out one of their products last year when they sent me the OneMo backpack, which really demonstrated to me how much thought they really put it into their products. That thing is so awesome. So today I'm gonna to show you these three great products that they sent me. I think many of you are gonna find them interesting because if you're following me on this channel, you're gonna find these products useful. And then I'm also gonna revisit a couple of their items that I've been using now for a while. I kinda of wanna update you on how I've been using them and how they're standing up. So let's check out some products from PGY Tech. Hey, welcome back to the channel. And for those of you that are here for the very first time, my name is Russ and I make videos about drones as well as a variety of other related tech. I invite you to browse around the channel after you're done watching this video. And if you find value in my content, I would love it if you join the community. So over the past few years, I've had the opportunity to check out new gear from a variety of companies. There's been quite a few that offer you know, they send us products, they send us creators products, and they say, can you check this out and let your viewers know if it's a good product or if it's not a good product. And in this process, I've found a lot of companies that just kind of want to push out their products and they want to make a profit. But there are some companies that actually want to innovate and inspire with their products. And PGY Tech is one of those companies. I haven't been working with them very long, you know, just over, I think last fall, so maybe last August is when I got that one more backpack. I'm not sure what it is, but Everything that I've used from them is made with very high quality materials and I found that they put a lot of time into fine tuning things when they do their design process. Now this video isn't sponsored, it's just me telling you my opinion of the quality and the value of these products. So the first one that I want to show you is a suction cup mount and it's a suction cup mount on steroids. Quick story about three years ago, my family and I were out boating and the kids were on the tube and I wanted to hook up the GoPro to the side of the boat to get some action shots of them as I was pulling them around the lake. Now I had one of these budget uh, suction cup mounts from Amazon. It's like one of those ones where you pay like 20 bucks and you get like 64 different action camera mounts. So most of it is crap. There's a few good things in there, but so I was using this suction cup and as I attached it, it wasn't this one. It was one just like this one because I think I got two when I got that kit. But as soon as I attached it to the boat and I thought it was locked down, uh, as soon as I let go, kerplunk right down into the bottom of the lake. Now, if I would have had a good suction cup, like this one from PJY Tech, it would not have happened. This one from PJY Tech is basically the suckiest of suction cups that you can find. And I mean that in the very best way. It's so good, it really sticks. So the whole thing is constructed of ABS plastic and aluminum alloy, and it just feels solid. It can be adjusted to pretty much infinite angles. And the best thing is this quick release wrench design that PGY Tech has, you know, rather than that typical thumb screw lock that we're used to seeing on action cameras. It has these simple pin locks or lever locks. They're super convenient and very innovative. You can use this mount in many creative ways and achieve creative angles. Now, most people are gonna probably use it to mount it on a vehicle, but you can also use it like inside the vehicle. You can use it as a dash cam. You can stick it on the kitchen counter. If you have like a cooking channel, you can stick it on the bathroom mirror or in your bedroom mirror. I don't know why you would be doing that, but you can. <laughs> but you can stick it to any smooth non-porous surface and it will stay there. And it also comes with a quarter mount adapter so you can attach anything to it. <laughs> Just kidding. Don't ever do that. So that's the suction cup from PJY Tech. Now the next thing that I wanna show you is probably the most versatile universal kit for the Osmo Pocket. Oh, the Osmo Pocket, I still use it so much. It's so good. It continues to be one of the best investments that I've ever made. If you haven't seen my video that shows you my idea of the perfect vlogging setup, go ahead and watch this right here. I'll put it up here also down in the description. Watch that video because I still use it as uh, as I show in that video. It really is a great setup. Now this kit right here comes with three innovative mounts for your Osmo Pocket. The first one is a data port mount or data port wherever you live. I say data. It locks into the data port, which is incredibly simple yet genius. It's made of solid ABS plastic, so 
There's no worries about durability. It's just one single piece. And then once you have that attached, you can mount the Osmo Pocket to like a hand grip or a selfie stick or a tripod or whatever you want to. And then the kit also comes with this standard quarter 20 tripod mount and that super cool pin lock that PJY Tech has. And then this L bracket mount. Now the L bracket mount is very well thought out because with this on, you can have your Wi-Fi module attached to your Osmo Pocket, which I actually don't have, but you can charge it without removing the mount. And so that's really handy. I know a lot of people like to leave their Wi-Fi module on there while they're charging uh, their Osmo Pocket. And when you put all three of these together, you have countless ways to position your Osmo Pocket. Now the next thing or things that I'd like to show you are these ND filters for the Mavic Mini. At the very beginning of this video, I mentioned how awesome the Mavic Mini is now. You know, the Mavic Mini was pretty good for the price. You know, for the average person wanting to get into drones, it was it was sufficient. But now they recently added a firmware update. I'm not gonna do a video on it. I'll put a link in the description to one of my favorite videos that goes through the update, shows you everything that the update uh, added to the Mavic Mini. But the most important thing is that it added the ability to change the camera settings. By doing that, by adding that to the Mavic Mini, it pretty much turned this from a toy drone into a quasi semi-professional drone. So for those of you that got the Mavic Mini, you can now capture more cinematic footage. And I know you hear that all the time, but it really is true. The Mavic Mini is now a viable option for getting really nice aerial footage. Even with the recent announcement of the Mavic Air 2, I personally think this firmware update makes the Mavic Mini the best investment overall for a first time drone buyer. Now to accomplish that footage, that beautiful cinematic footage that everyone likes, it's pretty important that you use ND filters to get appealing footage, especially on sunny days. You really have to be using them on bright sunny days because what they do is they allow you to dial down your shutter speed and lower shutter speeds means smoother, more pleasing footage. So what I did is I went out today, I went out at 1.30 p.m. It was a very bright and sunny day. And first I flew with no filter. So here's what that looks like. As you can see from the histogram here, I had to crank that shutter speed all the way up to one over 1250, which made the footage look kind of stuttery and not very good. So then what I did is I threw on the ND64 and here's that. And it was just a little bit too dark. So I had to actually uh, turn up the ISO. And then I also had to dial the shutter speed down to one over 50, which worked, but it's not ideal. So then what I did is I landed, I put on the ND32 and that gave me the perfect combination of shutter speed at one over 60 and the ISO of 100. This professional filter pack from PGY Tech for the Mavic Mini is made from high quality aluminum and glass. And just like their other products, they come with a lifetime warranty. So it's a great, great investment. And it really shows the confidence that PGY Tech has in their products. Now, two more bonus products that I wanna show you from PGY Tech, just in case you haven't seen my previous reviews of these products, I'll put those down in the description. I'll also put them up here, but this is the compact case for the Mavic Mini from PGY Tech. It's the minimalist way to carry everything that you need for your Mavic Mini excursion. It holds your controller, your drone, your batteries, your cables, everything that you need fits perfectly into this. And then on top of that, this thing fits perfectly into this, the One Mo backpack. This is the very first product from PGY Tech that I had an opportunity to check out and it is awesome. If you haven't seen this thing yet or if you haven't heard of it, watch my video review on it. It's so versatile, it's customizable, it holds so much and the storage compartments are very well thought out and constructed. This is what I use to transport all of my gear, my cameras, audio, lighting, drones, tripod, and of course my snacks. This thing is in the top five products that I have ever used since I started this channel over three years ago. So check it out, trust me, you will be very impressed. So there you have five really nice products from PGY Tech, a little something for everyone. Now these uh, ND filters, the professional ND filter set from them for the Mavic Mini, I think are probably the most appealing for most of you. You know, a lot of you have the Mavic Mini or you're planning on getting the Mavic Mini. I'm gonna have links down in the description where you can purchase all of these items. But with these filters, they're not gonna be available in the United States for at least another month, I think mid-June or late June. So if you want these, you're gonna have to wait a little bit, but everything else is available. Like I said, there's links down in the description if you wanna learn more about them or purchase them. And one more thing in the comments today, let's play a little bit of a game. Let's see who can guess 
the date that this channel will achieve 100,000 subscribers. It's getting pretty close. I hope to get it here this summer. But when I get to 100,000 subscribers, what I'm gonna do is I'll come back to this video and I'll see if anyone got it exactly correct. And if anyone does, what I'll do is I'll give them a shout out on the channel in my 100,000 subscriber video. And then I'll also I'll send them a little something. So just something a little bit different in the comments. Make sure you let me know if you have any questions about any of this stuff. I'll do my best to answer them. If I can't answer them, I'll find someone who can answer your question. I wanna thank you for watching the video today. Have a wonderful day. And as always, fly safe and fly smart.